What's going on guys? It's a rainy Friday and I want to show you the place I first worked when I was a teenager. I guess I was 16. This was Bird's Grocery Store and I made $5 an hour. So times have changed, thankfully. It's now this bowling alley. I don't even know if this is a no... I assume it's still a bowling alley. I don't know. I'd... It used to be a cooler bowling alley that actually had a, had a cool beer selection at their bar. It's like a lot of people don't like because a lot of people do want to drink beer while they bowl. You know, bowling is kind of lame in itself, in my opinion. But so, but back in the 90s, 80s and 90s, that was actually a Maxway. That was our town's Maxway. And then this was Bird's Grocery Store. Now, Bird's got bought out by Lowe's and uh, Lowe's Foods ended up being, end up, um, it's still around and actually now they've re, you know remarketed the whole blows it's kind of like a harris teeter now kind of an expensive grocery store so but back then bird i mean back in the 90s uh the birds became lows and this was a lows for a while but it was totally different than the lows that you know now if you live in north carolina but yeah i worked here i can't believe it. i made five dollars an hour here i didn't work here real long it was my uh like I said, it was my very first job though, 1996. I want to say I started around the spring of 96. I'm probably here a month or two. I don't know, but and then I went. You know, I worked a lot of fast food. I, you know, a few. Fa I've worked Taco Bell, KFC, and then uh, there, which no longer exists either. And then, God, I worked in uh, you know, some factories. I, you know, waited tables. I did a lot of things from 16 to 20. And that was a Rite Aid. That's, that was a Rite Aid for many years. Of course, across the street is the the old White's furniture. This is 1881 on it, but that building isn't quite that old. It's early 1900s. But good old. But the building, I guess. I mean, they probably remodeled it a bit. But and then the, I wanted. The, they did add that addition. It seems like that wall is pretty old too. But. Um, you know, it did seem like they had the old school glass of, you could see out the front, like it had the old school glass. So they did remodel it at some point, maybe in the late, late, ni late 90s, early 2000s. I I'm not sure, but the, M the Maxway does look the same. Now, it became a Madison Rivers, I believe. I Actually, I, yeah, I did. And my dad worked there for a little tiny bit in that little building. I don't believe he worked there a whole a heck of a long time, but crazy though. But it is it is morning time, so I doubt the bowling alley. It's if it it's probably not open. I can't remember for the life of me what it was, what bowling alley, what the bowling alley was called prior to this one. So, but cool. Well, I'll see you guys later. Thank you. Here's a picture of an old bird's, it looks like back in the 70s, just judging by the cars, but uh, yeah, that's kind of what the, what it looked like.